Hello and welcome to Minikun Tutorials. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to extract pages of a PDF document into separate PDF files or into a combined PDF document. Okay, so what I simply mean, mean is that if you have maybe your PDF document, you could choose to extract, for instance, all the pages of your PDF document into separate PDF documents you know or you could extract certain number of these pdf uh, documents into a combined pdf file or into separate pdf files as well so please stay tuned and let me show you how that works to do this you of course would need adobe acrobat reader dc pro if you are using the free version i'm sorry but you might not be able to do this you will have to upgrade to the um, pro version and it's very very simple um, one other thing that you need to note is that we have like um, let's say PDF files could come in different forms we, we could have just a simple PDF file which does not really need um, you don't need to when you open a simple a simple PDF file like this particular one you don't have to activate uh, what you call it or enable editing but all the editing tools will automatically be activated so if i want to for instance um if i want to let's say extract pages of this particular pdf file that i have here all i have to do is to click on tools come and click on organize pages and i have the extract button here but let me open the second pdf and show you something if i should open this particular pdf here you would notice that this is a PDF, a, sorry, a PDF slash A file. A, the PDF slash A file is simply the official form of um, saving a PDF file. That is like when we have official documents like scientific letters, it could be a book, any document at all that is deemed official. The best way to save it is to save it as a PDF, a PDF slash A file. And such files you can only activate the editing tools by first of all enabling editing so if you don't enable editing you cannot proceed with um, extracting pages of the document so make sure you enable editing if you have such a file and then click on ok and the good news is that after you've edited your document after you've extracted your pages if you still want to save the document as a pdf slash a file you can still do that by clicking on file followed by save as you could put it on which part of your computer that you want you browse and select the right folder and then you make sure you click on the drop down menu and select pdf slash a file that is not the purpose of our tutorial it was just to tell you that in case you are about to uh, split sorry or extract pages of a PDF document that is in the form of a P like um, once you just have the notice appeared here that you should enable modification make sure you enable modification else the tools the modification tools will not be or the editing tools will not be activated all right so let's assume we want to proceed by extracting let's say pages of this particular PDF file it's something very very simple that we can do okay or if you want we could uh, this particular one has bookmarks and it's looking a more official but a little bit more complex so if you want we could just close this it's the same principle all you have to do is click on tools click on organize pages then come and click on let's say extract okay and once you click on extract you have the choice you could extract uh, let's say even pages that depends on the rationale behind your extraction I don't know why you would want to extract even pages before you extract even pages you must know what the content of those even pages are if not you could extract even pages so you realize that it has selected how uh, all paired pages page numbers you know excluding odd pages like 2, 4, uh, 6, 8, 10, you know, excluding 11, 7, which are odd. 
you could also choose to select all page, page numbers like this you know you could also choose to select uh, landscape pages imagine that like you have a very complex PDF document with landscape pages and then also portrait you could choose to if you want to extract only the landscape pages you just have the choice to say landscape and it will extract only landscape in our case we only have portrait so you see that nothing is selected if I should select let's say portrait then it selects everything because all the pages are actually put in portrait format the last thing is selecting all pages option so once when you select all pages option it's going to select all pages and the next question you have to ask yourself is what if I want to select specific pages okay maybe I don't want all pages neither do I want even neither do I want odd nor landscape nor portrait but I just want certain pages of my own choice in this case just click outside and select everything this way and then select the first page that you want to extract let's assume I want to extract the, the, the abstract which is here the first page and maybe the fourth page then I simply press the control key press and hold the control key and come and select the fourth page once you select the fourth page you can proceed with your extraction if you want to select all pages then you do so you just simply say all pages here and it selects everything now the other question that you have to ask yourself is do I want to extract these files as combined as a combined file in other words do I want to combine all the selected files or I want to extract them as separate files there wouldn't be any logic trying to to extract all the pages as a combined file why because then it's better keeping the original document right but you could choose to combine certain pages let's assume I want to combine page number four and five or I want to combine all odd pages or I want to combine all portrait pages or landscape pages or even pages then I could do that by just here but once again remember I told you that in case you want to select only um, you, you want to select certain pages of your choice then you have to select the page that you want hold the control key select the next next page for instance page one and four I want to extract them now you would ask me do I want to extract them as individual pages or separate documents or do I want to combine them in case I want to extract them as a combined PDF then I just click on extract here and you see that automatically Adobe opens another tab with the combined document which is here so we have the abstract here page number one and the last page that I took which is page number four and I can now go ahead and save the combined documents after this I'll show you how you can extract them as separate files so I want to save, save this as a combined document so I simply click on the file option click on save as click on my computer let me browse okay I'll put it on my desktop and I'll name it let's say uh, extracting page no extract extract and combine okay so I've, I'll name it extract and combine it's a new folder that I, no sorry I have to create this new folder on the desktop and name it extract and combine and simply make sure I select the created folder so I have to select make sure I select extract and combine and simply open it click on save and then on my desktop I will find my extract and com the, the, I mean the two pages that I extracted and combined so I have the combined document here and I would send it to whoever that I want to send or whatever purpose that I want to use it for so let me close this tab and continue with and let's restart with something different
so let's just close all tabs i don't want to save anything because i've already saved the file that i wanted which is here now just open the original document and do one last thing which is extracting them as separate files if i want to extract them as, a, as separate files then i simply open the file here so once again if it's a pdf slash a they will tell you to enable editing make sure you enable editing first of all and now we're gonna extract the pages as what um separate files so let's click on tools click on organize pages and let's assume i want to extract all the pages as what separate files in that case i would just want to separate everything into individual files then i simply click over here and select all files let's assume i want to then i just say for instance um, click on let's say extract when you click on extract make sure you click on you, you check extract as extract pages as separate files for instance and then you just go ahead and hit on extract now it opens this dialog box, browse where you want to put it, let's say on the desktop and yes, I can create a new folder that will call, right click on the new folder and name it, I will name it for instance, extract as separate. Extract as separate, okay. Now click on OK and after which your files will be saved. So if I should go to the desktop and click on open extract as separate, I have all 11 files saved here. All 11 pages are saved here. So this is just one page here, the abstract. The next one is a single page. This is the next one here. As a single page that is the second page and at that order in the same way if we wanted to extract let's say page one and five as separate files then you have to do the same if you want to extract let's say page one and five as separate files come and click on tools organize pages select page or let's assume you wanted to extract two three and five so you select page two Press the control key, select page 3 and page uh, 5 here. Now go ahead and hit extract as separate files because you don't want to combine them. If you want to combine them, then don't, then don't check extract pages as separate files. But if you want to, com to separate them, then you make sure you check this and click extract. And then you follow the same steps as I showed you. You open your desktop, create a new folder, name it whatever that you want to name it. Go ahead and just hit OK, and the files will be saved there. If I should go to my desktop right now, this is the new folder that I created, and I have the three separate pages one, two, three, and five. Thank you so much for watching, and please subscribe. Bye.